You go into your shower feeling, but as soon as you reach for the Irish Spring, your day immediately gets better. That crisp, fresh, unmistakable Irish Spring scent zings your brain and awakens your senses. So when you finally emerge from the shower, 37 minutes later, because you pay the water bill so you can stay in there as long as you want, you're ready to take on the day and smell great doing it. Irish Spring Body Wash and Bar Soap. Fresh, green, Irish. Shop now at Walmart. From hobby farmers to weekend gardeners and everyone in between, Tractor Supply trusts 5G solutions from T-Mobile for Business to make shopping more personal. Together, we're connecting over 2,200 stores with 5G business internet and powering AI so team members can match shoppers with products faster. You're all set. This is enriching customer experience. This is Tractor Supply with T-Mobile for Business. Take your business further at T-Mobile.com slash now. What makes the Steelers so good at blocking kicks? Uh, number one, they're coached up really well. Danny Smith has been doing a hell of a job in this league for a long time, so I got tre tremendous respect for him. And their players play the game the right way. Um, they're very fundamentally sound. They play together. Uh, they play with purpose. And obviously, um, like you guys know, they've been able to pressure and block kicks very well. Um, so again, tremendous respect for them. Tremendous challenge for us this week. What is it about your return game? that you look at and say we have why we haven't been able to you know break anything or get anything really out of that yeah um i think it starts when you want to get your return game going you got to hold up on the perimeter number one to knock a hole in it and when i say knock a hole in it you got to get your return game started um so when when you're talking about punt return that's the first priority is we got to improve on the perimeter um the second thing based off of a certain situation in the game down in distances there's certain things that we may feel more inclined to do based off of pressuring or return. Um, in some cases, you may get a return out of a pressure. You may get a, um, you may get no return out of a pressure. But the, the number one thing is we got to improve in terms of our perimeter play, and then our guys have to do a better job of sticking and staying on their blocks for a longer period of time. The nature of any punt play, it's it's really the toughest seven to ten seconds of any football play. I mean, it's so long when you think about what you're asking your return team to do and what you're asking your punt team to do. At what point, at what, at one point, you don't have the ball. So you got to make sure you're playing defense first, all right, because you don't want to give up a fake. And at another point, you're getting the ball. So it's that transitional period where it is a long time to do right. Um, so we got to put our guys in better position. That starts with me uh, in practice in terms of feeling what that length of a play feels like to be able to execute the early down part of it and the later down part of it. How do you get better at that printer? Is it personnel, scheme? Or like, What's the, the change that would make that be better? At yeah, I, I think the personnel, is it, that's what we have. My job is to get those guys better. So when we're on the field, it is legitimately practice, practicing that play for that entirety, whether it's a full cover, understanding that you still are trying to get your guys ready to play a game, um, so not necessarily burning them out as well. There's balance to that, and I think that's what coaching is, is at what point are you pressing these guys to make sure that they're ready to play physically um, to where you might have to take off a little bit of that physical element, but also understand there is a mental clock in this game. They understand you know, the, the length of that play as well, but they also have to feel what that feels like. So you could do it at a, a, a tempoed pace, but just making certain they understand these are your block mechanics as we get closer and closer to the return. How's Graham doing? Uh, I'll, all injury question can go to Dave's. Um, I know he's been I, out here. I was just yeah. wondering if he got to the point where you were able to at least see him kick at any point yet, or is it still like I haven't had the opportunity. Yeah, I haven't had the opportunity to to see him do the physical stuff. Um, you know, my, my focus has been on been on our guys. Um, I, I see Graham around. He's got a smile on his face, and I know he's chomping in the bit to get ready to get going again. Did you know that one in eight kids in Atlanta will go hungry tonight? Eating healthy, balanced meals is essential for kids to learn and grow. That's why Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield, an education nonprofit Common Threads, have teamed up to help schools learn about healthier food preparation. In Atlanta, they're joined by the dream and will provide education, recipes, and knowledge to students and families about healthier options. Visit anthem.com slash dream to learn more. Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield is the trade name of Blue Cross Blue Shield Healthcare Plan of Georgia, Inc. 
Good sleep should come naturally. And with the new Natural Hybrid mattress, it can. A collaboration between Lisa and West Elm, the Natural Hybrid is expertly crafted from natural latex, natural wool, and certified safe foams to elevate your sleep sanctuary and support a greener tomorrow. Breathable organic cotton and moisture-wicking Joma wool consistently provide cool and comfortable slumber. Every purchase helps fuel Lisa's work with shelters and those in need. Visit lisa.com to learn more. That's l-e-e-s-a dot com.